It's been a week, one week, since we got a new maximum leader. Oh, doesn't it seem a long time ago? But you wouldn't know there'd even been a change. If you watched Kevin Rudd today, it was like he'd never gone away. Let's look at a day in the life of our new old PM. Uh, I'm sure there were other meetings. He did talk about Gonski, but the emphasis is really on the world stage, isn't it? He met with the Chinese ambassador. There was time to head over to the US Embassy for a bit of July 4 celebrations the day in ended with an um, interview from the Prime, Prime Ministerial Office, looking very presidential with the flag behind him. I know you have to do everything to win points in this current competition, but can I say, this is all happening on a day that the stock market and the Australian dollar are plummeting. The Reserve Bank Governor came out with some very controversial comments about the economy being a bit slow and some concerns there, but no, 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 we're focusing on the bigger picture, the world outlook. We're off to Indonesia tomorrow, very important, on boat policy, asylum seekers, of course, but uh, you do kind of wonder where the emphasis or when the emphasis is going to come back to the domestic issues like, oh, I don't know, an election perhaps? It's not just that we know he's waiting to continue this, what one commentator called, lap of honour around the world. No, 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 I'm sure not. But just in case you think I'm being a bit harsh, my personal favourite of the last 24 hours was the Prime Ministerial Office releasing this photo of Kevin Rudd. Now, as one wag said, uh, he could have been ordering pizza, he could have been talking to Therese. No, this was a photo to alert us that he was talking to President Obama, taking a congratulatory call. Really? Really? Do you think the president's office in the US is tweeting a similar one, saying, look, we're talking to Kevin Rudd? He also did call Julia Gillard, I should note. But the more I look at that photo and look at the itinerary today and the more I see no talk of an election, I do think to myself, you know, they claim this is the new look Kevin. Well, from where I'm sitting, he looks awfully like the old Kevin.